as I said, I had a background in running, and I think there was a, a link here. The, the running caused the, the hip problem. So I used to do a lot of running. I used to do marathons, North Wales Marathon, um, Birmingham Marathon, Stoughton Trent's Marathon. I completed five marathons, about three half marathons, and I had a background in athletics well into my 50s. I, I was running well. Um, I had my last run with one of my daughters in 2006 and I felt uncomfortable and struggled. I didn't realise that was going to be my last run pre-operation, but that was it. I couldn't cope. I completed the run and she congratulated me, but I was in pain and I didn't feel well. And I thought, that is it. Goodbye to running. Initially, I have to admit, I couldn't stand on one leg. That, that for me was the test. Can I stand on the, um, some call it the bad leg, but it should be called the much better leg. I couldn't. I attended the physiotherapy class over a period of a month or five weeks, and that helped considerably strengthen the hip. And before I knew it, I could stand on one leg. Everything falls back into place slowly, gradually, almost without you realising it. Getting rid of the crutches, I can't give you a date. It happened. Getting rid of the walking stick, I can't tell you the date. It happened. I think I lost it somewhere, which is a lovely thing to do. Um, so I attended physiotherapy classes, I went swimming, that helped as well. So in May, one of my daughters came home and said, look dad, come for a run. I said, no I can't, I've got a new hip. I can't go running. She said, just come for a mile, half a mile that way and half a mile back. And I did. And it worked, and my hip was okay. The next one was in August, so we're looking at operation in December. I was running in May, six months. Within six months, not only could I stand on one leg, I could go running again, albeit not a long run. In August, my other daughter came home and said, we've got a improve on the last one, Dad, let's go for a run. And I did a three miler with my daughter. And since January, I run three miles every morning. 